by Sarah. What can you tell us? Well, Colette, Lisa Smith cried when the guilty verdict was read out by uh, Mr Justice Tony Hunt in the past short while. The three-judge special criminal court found that the prosecution had proved beyond reasonable doubt that the 40-year-old mother of one and former member of the Defence Forces was a member of terrorist organisation IS between 2015 and 2019. Mr Justice Tony Hunt said that she took up membership of IS when she crossed the border from Turkey into Syria in 2015. He also said the court rejected the contention that she answered the call to migrate to the territory controlled by IS based on her religious beliefs. He said she rejected matrimonial and family ties in favour of adherence to IS. Uh, the court also stated that she knew IS was an unlawful uh, terrorist organisation as opposed to a religious organisation. The court referred to her social media exchanges over the years. One of, in one of those, uh, he said he her reaction to a terrorist attack in Tunisia. She responded by saying bye-bye tourism, ha ha ha, lol. The judge described these interactions as offensive and the court said she accepted the violent sentiments and offered to continue with the exchanges. The court uh, rejected any contention that she was naive or ignorant on the contrary, saying that she was well informed, uh, knew what she was doing and it was of course the prosecution's case during this nine-week trial that she had enveloped herself in the black flag of IS today. She stands convicted, the first person to be convicted of membership of IS here. Uh, she will be sentenced on the 11th of July and on that date she faces a maximum term of eight years. Uh, just to uh, let you know, she also was, she was acquitted of the second charge against her, which was financing uh, terrorism in May 2015. She has been remanded on continuing bail until the 11th of July when she faces a maximum term of 11 years. Sarah, Eight thank you years, very much.